Hello? Hello? How's it going, y'all? Can y'all hear me loud and clear? Goodbye, all. Oh. Goodbye. Goodbye? Goodbye? Can't hear me at all. That's a shame. All right. Ah, close my door real quick. One sec. All right, all right, all right. Stalker time. Old Squeaky's back, and not for long. New chair should come in tomorrow. Should. I ordered the chair straight from the manufacturer, because it was cheaper. Uh, but it was coming from Canada, so it was taking its dear sweet time. Got delayed at customs, it looks like. It's, unfortunately, they found all the hidden crack cocaine, so that's taking a little bit extra longer. Gotta talk to the police. But shouldn't be a problem. Uh, So... Let's see. Today, nothing changed from yesterday. Playing on the hardest difficulty with um, Hardcore AI aim. Uh, which was pretty fucking brutal yesterday, but it was fun. Scary as fuck fighting Monolith in that red forest. That was a hell of a time. Got stuck in the Suez. Uh, yeah, in the Suez, Canada. Uh, most people don't know this, but uh, the Suez Canal actually goes uh, through Canada. Damn Canadians are blocking uh, blocking shipping. It's payback for all the Canadian jokes. Motherfuckers. Uh, okay. Canada next to Egypt, yeah. It goes Canada, Egypt, India, uh, United Kingdom. Oh, uh, and Libya. Libya's there, too. There we go. So I'm running Warfare uh, A Life Overhaul again, and we're going to try the random start Azazel mode. Uh, Ventar said that should work with Warfare, so we're going to try it out. I haven't tested it, but this is, this is what we're doing here today. Let's see. So Azazel Warfare, hard survivalist. Uh, we'll start as... Let's do Bandit again. We didn't really get to play Bandit very much. Maybe we'll start actually at our home base so we have a chance. <laughs> Watching a stream while playing Euro Truck Simulator 2, it's relaxing. I do something very similar, point blank. I like to play like uh, kind of passive games, like either something turn based uh, or just like uh, Factorio. I've been playing Dyson Spear Program recently off stream. Been loving that game. But yeah, I I listen to like school lectures or watch streams while I do that, and it's easy to multitask because it activates like different parts of my brain. I can always just stop what I'm doing and listen or watch whenever something something important or interesting comes up. But yeah, uh, Dyson Spear Program, early access game. It's Factorio, but space. Really good. Really enjoying that. Really pretty game too. Uh, I like that one. What should our name be? Should we return the Ivan Dick Shrink? Didn't really get a chance last time. Didn't last very long. Oh, wait. 
Because body health add on, I need to make sure I get the right meds. I believe. So yeah, side block gives you head, uh, post heal. This stuff is not balanced for that though. It's just kind of a pain. It's so expensive too. I might have to change up what I start with using the spawn menu. Chad Thundercock, that's that's too much. Mike Oxlong. Mike Oxlong, oh god. Oh man. That's that's pretty good actually. I'm doing that one. Mike Oxlong. Okay. Uh, bandage. Yeah. Okay. All good here. All good here. This is all right. Dark Valley Factory Bandit. Let's go. Mike Oxwoolen. <laughs> Mike Oxwoolen. <laughs> But yeah, fact Factorio is just like where did the entire day go? <laughs> oh, this is oh right, because it's random start location. This doesn't look like the Dark Valley. <laughs> New voice lines. Uh, one second. Okay, no, that's not improving my frame rate at all. I was trying something to see if it affects it. Uh, let me exit a few things that are not necessary. There we go. All oh, right, preview mode turned off on OBS because that's a pain in the ass. No game sound. I forgot to unmute it. I mean, the OBS broke. Oh, man. There we go. Should be good now. Yeah, darn OBS forces me to mute it. Yeah, Grok's rework of body health system seems pretty, pretty good. Had no problems so far, but there's a lot of new stuff to learn. Okay. Yeah, that bandit's got a fucking SVD. That guy's vest broke. Wait, what? Hey, that guy's got a suit plus a uh, bandit suit plus vest. Oh, <laughs> it looks a little odd. I see. Oh no, that's the model. I don't know. SVD guy's vest. Oh yeah, it's glitching through. I see it now. <laughs> it's not properly rigged. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, I didn't notice that. Wasn't looking for it. Yeah, that's uh, that's a little broke. It's a little broke. A little bit. Just a little bit. Cool. Looking for a guy to leave an army warehouse right in McCord, north of the north of the northern checkpoint, Chumka Pepper. You can go to army warehouses. That's not too far. I'm not sure what's uh, causing that, or what's adding those models. Maybe it's the new voice line mod. Firefight just broke out by the farm.
Uh, let's see. Where are bandits located? There's some bandits in army warehouses. Okay. Just one squad. Oh, right. Uh, let me go to settings. Zone warfare. And we're going to load warfare overhaul. Fat. No, it's normal. Apply. Yeah. Auto capture time five minutes. Oh yeah, so that to uh usually set it to like one minute so it's faster. Uh forget that all that changes. Uh ch -ch -ch wait time one. Distance, set that a little lower, 25, and auto capture on. I use at least the fast. Yeah, you're right. I remember last time it took forever for anyone to catch up. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. You're right. I thought about doing it, but I was like, maybe it might cause performance trouble. Okay. I have the uh, spawn rate turned down much lower. There's someone on the road way out there. Way out there. Who's the, Who's the guy? Need a guide? It's an army warehouses south of the road to Dead City. I'll pay you 6,000 rubles for the job. Keep in mind, you won't get full payment. We don't get there in time. Yeah, but that's, that's doable. Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Uh, oh, right. I don't have... only have one magazine. I'll have to spawn another one. I'm gonna spawn... Oops, I just gave myself a random mag on accident. Uh, that's modified, standard. Give myself two extra. I guess I'll a Beretta mag on accident. The reason the sound's broken on this. Kind of weird. Add to loadout. Add to loadout. Check mag. Add to loadout. Cool. Let's go, boys! Hello there. Hello, hello. You have the crazy mutant mod on for this playthrough? What do you mean? The dynamic mutants? Where it spawns randomized mutants? Mm, yeah, I'm running out. I have always had that on, but it's always turned down a little lower. I usually keep it at like 20% of vanilla settings because it gets fucking nutty. It runs like crap, too. Okay, I don't know what's going to be here. There's some guys running around up ahead. No idea if they're friendly or not. We fire at will, but we're going to stealth. No, I'm not using the radiation overhaul. Hasn't been updated, has it? Oh, 
Oh, it was? Oh, cool. I might have to get that done. I enjoyed that mod. It was hard as fuck, but I enjoyed it. Oh, they would know who they're shooting at! There's a guy over there just suppressing fire, I guess? I don't know. Let's go, boys! Whoa, you guys got a suppressed pistol. Get him? I think they got him, yeah. Loner here. Some documents. I haven't seen the, uh, whatchamacallit, the mod that claim loot mod work at all yet. I've never seen anyone say anything about claiming loot. Yeah, that call just did have a decent FM45. Probably already taken, but I wasn't even gonna bother. Oh, shotgun too. Yeah, it's not bad. Get him, boy. Love that suppressed AK sound. Oh, they're shooting back. I thought they were just flushes. Zombies. I love these new voices. I feel like they fit perfectly. Not the right ammo, I just try to load. It's nice because there's so much variety that like every single stalker has their own voice lines now. Hardcore AI aim is turned on, right? I don't have to set that every time. Yeah. What are y'all shooting at? <laughs> Just trying to kill that one guy. Fracture. This is... It's kind of cool, but it's weird. getting irradiated. I wasn't realizing. I <sighs> finally get it. Jesus. Wasted about 300 rounds. Yeah, vodka gets rid of rats slowly. It's not very effective and it makes you drunk. Probably need to take more. I probably got a lot of rats there.
kind of sucks that I'm out of uh, vodka now, though. Is a mistake? Wonder if anyone's got any uh, anti reds. What is that model? He's got like a a pelt over his head. Yeah, I got cigarettes. That's true. Do I have any matches? No. So, oh yeah, I do. I do. I do. Okay. Which mod makes a voice lines random? It's in the list. I can't remember what it's called exactly. It's like a Russian name. It's in the in the mod list. It's not Russian. I changed the t name of it so you can see. Oh sh! sh, sh. I almost fucking died. Almost walked right into an anomaly. Mods, just mods. I mean, and uh, there's a new load order that I from the stuff I changed yesterday. That seems closer than it should be. Fucking red rads! Ah! We're good. What? Uh, y'all deal with that. I'm a smoke. Let the boys deal with it. Yeah, I'm using the EFT profiles. I am. Maybe it's a compatibility patch issue. Maybe I messed up the uh, load order or something. I'm not sure. Yeah, you, all the guns have been fine except for that one. Flashes. That guy was running and being attacked by dogs. Watch out behind you, dude! I got your back, bro. Oh, he's coming back. I got you. That goes half my ammo. Good, he's just lying around. Look at Lucky. Probably gonna jam like crazy. What were y'all guys shooting at? Where'd this guy go? There he is. Dog's dead. Ooh, nice. You are a high rank dude. All right, stepping it up in the world. my uh what okay that's something's changed there got the scope for now I was gonna go through the truck cemetery but we can actually go through the bar duty's not gonna be there everything's switched well I'm hearing shooting at the border so maybe not 
gonna be just as dangerous to go through the uh, dark valley, I think. He's shorter to go through the bar. So I think we should. Maybe the flea market's here. Sell some stuff. Yeah, you can buy mags at Traders. They don't always have every mag, but usually have relevant mags. Any friendlies on the map? No, sir. Big gun. Zombies? <laughs> oh, he's having a good time. Whoa! <laughs> no flea market trader, unfortunately. Cool. <laughs> Loner died here. Hey, some ammo, finally. Fix this up real quick. Ah, right, I got some 9 by 18. Good. Ah, what you're gonna me for? Fucker? Fuck you up. Didn't even have a gun out. You can uh, stop stealth, boys. All right, to the bar. I need to turn off auto capture. We're uh, doing the thing we did last time where we're taking over the whole zone, like without even realizing it. Not much, Alza. We've just been walking around, shot a few guys. We're leading some boys to the, to the uh, army warehouse. No, this is anomaly. Area is uh, it needs some some changes. So you removed Ukrainian voices. I got both loaded actually, but I have Ukrainian voices loaded before, so it overwrites. Fleshy boys, get them. Yeah, I feel like it shouldn't take 16 buckshot to kill that bloodsucker. Or more. <laughs> Wonder who's going to be at the bar.
Yeah, I don't know what you're supposed to do with that, Alza. It doesn't seem like there's any way to get past him without fighting. And you don't have the resources to fight, so I don't know what you're expected to do. Yeah, we have randomized start location on right now, so everything is thrown out of whack. Luckily, we started in the cordon, which is pretty close to where we usually start. But Judy's going to have a completely different starting location. Which way are you supposed to get past them, then, Alza? Uh, okay, so just running. <laughs> There's no sneaking way to do it. Flashes up ahead. Oh, shit. The machine gun is manned. I saw someone in there, and I think there's an oncologist. Oh, no zombies. Just zombies. Parkour. Oh shit. Yeah, I see you. Everything's randomized. Ooh, wow. Too bad it's completely destroyed, but cool. Azazel means when you uh, when you die, you take over as someone else in the world rather than starting a whole new game. It's like Iron Man, but a little bit different. So it is one life Iron Man. There's German Shepherd here. But uh, you take over the life of... I think it's supposed to be either Companion or just someone else randomized. You can use it as a grenade launcher. Oh, yeah, you're right. I could, but it's fine. Someone left the music on. Can you be dog? No, unfortunately. There's no dog faction, and it's a shame. Guys? Behind us? What's going on? That's a dog, guys. Know what they're freaking out about. Come on. Let's ignore it. Come to me. Yeah, it's completely random. Someone else in the world. Oh shit. Ah! Fuck, they're on in nor combat. <laughs> the good smack. No, padarvale, pasane. Oh shit! Got loners here? Reload my ammo before I forget. It's a little... I'm seeing a lot of visual bugs. Like, sometimes it won't tell me the proper amount of ammo when I'm looting someone. But it's only visual. Once you pick it up, it'll tell you 
what uh what they have properly. It's as overall it's been working pretty good. I've been enjoying it. Definitely improved from last time. Fuck! Where are my friends helping me? Where'd he go? Whoa! What? Good pistol. Once again, <laughs> he served into a bus when you heard gunshots. Pro tip don't get shot while driving. Little, little known trick there. Little, little, little trick from, uh, from me to you. No problem. Don't worry about it. Blood like everywhere here. Cool lighting in here. Barkeep's gone. Free food. Don't block me in. Yeah, there's no one here. Well, I think we can take the bar itself. Onward to the army warehouses. Did we not capture it? What? Yeah, I think we got it now. Do I need sub tokens? Why do you need? Uh, not sure what you mean. Sub tokens? I'm honestly not even sure what you mean. You mean like bits? Fuck. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> Point blank shotgun that man in the face. Finish him, damn it. Sub 
so bits are like pennies that you can give to a streamer. I think you get them from watching ads or you can buy them too. I think. Ooh, he's got an LR mag. Where does uh, LR go? Um, subscribing means you don't get ads on the channel you subscribe to anymore. It's five bucks. Um, a portion of the money goes to me or whatever streamer. Um, but yeah, bits are just like you can accumulate them and give them to a streamer. Uh, one bit is one penny, so 100 bits is a dollar. Uh, I got too much stuff. Let's, uh, we'll throw some stuff in a stash in the way. Does that answer your question? I think. Is there a check mag button? Should check the settings. I'm jam. I don't see a check magazine. Your current bet. Oh, right. So it just tells me the bullets. I'm so used to being like not knowing that that I assume I, I can't. I don't have that information. Oh, wait. I want to. Like I said there's no traders actually. So we'll find someone to buy all this shit another time. A renowned monster cooch possessor? <laughs> what? Um, the first two parts of that question are, it's pretty cool. I've, like, I've never made mods or anything before Anomaly. So it's really cool to put a ton of work into something and see it be appreciated. Um, being the main streamer in the community. I, I mean, I'm pretty equal with a lot of others right now. I guess I have. In the past, I've gotten a lot of viewers, but I'm probably the most established. I know, like, uh, Lenick gets about the same amount of viewers. He's a great streamer, too. Um, But, yeah, I don't think there was any English-speaking anomaly streamers when I started. So it's pretty cool to see a lot of people uh, start doing that. Yeah, I remember it said, uh, oh god, I'm so bad with name, Wizardry? Uh, the other Texas streamer? Um, he, uh, he said he, the reason he started streaming was from, uh, me streaming, too. Yeah, Regicide has also been going for a while, too. I think maybe just, has he gone just as long as me? I've only, honestly, I, I should have earlier, but I've only just, when I started playing Stalker again, did I start actually, like, seeing other people playing trying to like raid people like that trying to uh you know spread the love okay well that's must my bad registry's been going for a while too i guess i had the uh established channel uh from my just my youtube clips that i was able to build off of that's why i grew so quickly at first um yeah oh yeah people a lot of people don't like me because of politics of course i'm very opinionated i don't take bullshit so <laughs> Yeah, I'm a, I think I'm pretty uh, polarizing. That's just how I like it, baby. If you ain't got any enemies, you ain't doing it right. No, no, your enemies are wishing for your downfall. You ain't doing anything. Okay, uh, he wanted to be in the...
Hydrate? Oh yeah, my bad. I'm hydrating right now. Oh shit, he got shot. Yeah, let's get him, boy. Damn, nice work, guys. It's nice having my teammates actually be competent and able to handle themselves and even, like, win firefights. That's a uh, blind size animations, Plaid, plus weapon parts overhaul, I, th I believe. I can't remember which one. I know they work together. Oh, I should take that pistol and take the parts from it. Uh, sorry, I catch up with message. Is how are you liking the body health system? I'm enjoying it a lot. Six. Uh, I feel like it's mostly stable. I like the EFT medical overhaul, which is built on this, but I feel like it just added too much stuff. Like overall, it was kind of overwhelming. And Anomaly doesn't need more uh, more items. <laughs> it needs less. But uh, Grok's system seems a nice. Damn, you got some good shit on you. Grok's mod seems pretty stable. And uh, it's like he's done a lot of uh, polishing on it. Nice! Damn, these scientists were artifact hunting. Good shit. Good shit. With, uh, unjamming, I think it's G by default, with a weapon parts overhaul. There's a different key, but it depends on the severity of the jam. So, uh, standard jam is like press G and it like just reload, recock the gun, quick gun jam. Sometimes you get a catastrophic jam where you have to unjam then full reload. <sighs> Gotta find a home for those artifacts. to unload then unjam oh it's probably why i get my <laughs> get so fucked up by jams sometimes all right y'all want to go up here right they want to go up to the side field Oh boy. I can't get too close or I'll just fucking melt. So I need to heal. <sighs> and glucose shot, right? That gives me post heals? Yeah. So it's like the body health system does work like Tarkov, where you have temporary HP and permanent ah, rads. I knew there's rads up here. Oh shit, this guy's freedom. We're cool with freedom, right? Yeah, they'd be shooting at us already if we weren't. Uh, got some anti-rads. Probably got a bad dose. <gasps> But yeah, you get temporary HP from like quick heal items or med kits, and then you have to finish it off with the drug. I feel like they need to. Grok needs to rebounce stalker loot so you can actually get the items you need to heal. Because it's so more complex now than, um, like, 
being able to grab healing items from stalkers is not the same. Because usually they have like just one med kit and nothing else or something like that, you know? Which overall you can get a lot of loot from that, but it's not enough to be able to do full heals properly. But yeah, I feel like Grox works better than the EFT mod. It's also more minimalistic, which I enjoy. But I do think uh, the creator of the EFT medical overhaul put a lot of good work into it. Bloodsucker! Don't get isolated! Where'd he go? Stay with us! Oh. <laughs> get fucked, bloodsucker. Are we shooting at now? Zombie? That was it? Okay. Yeah, I do feel like the EFT mod needed uh, pricing rebalance really bad. Because, like, the surgery kits were, like, crazy expensive. Uh, I'm not going to get that. Oh, I forgot to... Damn it. I forgot to turn off limited bolts. Now I don't have any bolts. Uh, progression difficulty... Oh, he's sliding down. <laughs> ah, that's nothing. Look how he's awkwardly just sliding down, not moving. You pump shotguns ever even jam? Yeah, I mean, that it jammed multiple times when I just used it. I mean, in real life, I'm sure if it's damaged enough, it'll jam. Almost there. I don't know how we're gonna do this with the side field there. Do I have like a side block or side protection or anything? I don't think so. Maybe if I get close enough without actually getting into it, they'll be they'll be enough. Oh shit! Oh, you and ISG guy. Oh, he was dead. I thought he was still alive. I won't be able to uh, grab his loot, unfortunately. Without Cyblock. Put some tin foil on my head. <laughs> Fortunately, I'm, I'm, I'm fresh out. That gives me some Psy protection, but not very much. Yeah, I don't really have anything, unfortunately. Maybe the sleeping pills will be enough if I take two? It's a pretty strong side field, ain't it? We're gonna do some testing. I never use the sleeping pills at all, so I'm not sure. Um... Just do I about the job. Yeah, we're not close enough. 
Yeah, smoking a joint does give you side protection a little bit. We're gonna try this. God, I'm so tired now. Please protect! Oh. Oh. Ooh, nice guns. Okay, yeah, we're good. Uh... I think I just turned into a zombie. What? 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 This is stupid. What? <laughs> <laughs> um. Um, um, the side field must have killed me. It, I wasn't watching my side health, but the I went, I took over the control of one of the. <laughs> I was just kind of confused, Neil Bear. I wanted to see what would happen, but I think I'm, I think I'm just locked here. Can't do anything. I got an alt F4. A fate worse than death. Black screen forever. X-ray engine has seized control. I was watching my actual health rather than my psi health, which uh, just a mistake. Bad ending. <laughs> I want to be T pose. <laughs> Your wish is my command. A faith worse than death. I thought I was fine, Neo Bear. I was like, oh, my health is fine. I wasn't going down. I was like, oh, we're good. The two uh, sleeping pills were helping. But not actually... <laughs> not actually as much as I thought. Hidi Kamenye. Okay. Um, this is post-sleeping pills. Let's go grab the loot real quick. And then sprint back up. Grab, please. Damn it! I wasn't fast enough. I was almost there. I when I bumped my head on the uh, helicopter, it slowed me down. Let's try that again. We're learning. We're learning. Grab it, please. Damn it. Ah. It's like the... <laughs> Let me exit. I love that. That's hilarious. <laughs> I don't have anything else. Give me psi health, all right? Psi protection. Those artifacts I left, they, they might have helped, but I don't want to run all the way back. Maybe if I come from a different angle. is my game. Uh oh, bro, I can't even fucking move. 
safe. Fuck, I'm way over cumbered. So... Who's the guy I have to talk to to finish the mission? Was it that guy? I don't think it was that guy. It was the... It was the guy in, uh... No, it was the exosuit guy. Head is naked right now. Shit, I thought I had a... Mask. I might have used it for repairs on accident. Behind you, you missed him. Yeah, my vision's so blurry, I think I. Oh, yeah, there he is. Hard to see. Here we are. What? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Okay, I guess they're just sitting there. Yeah, I should take the helmet. Still walk at least. That's uh, not as bad as they thought it was going to be. I guess without the uh, Grox helmets, it's not as uh, strong of a difference. You know, SKS and SVD use different ammo. Hey, that's pretty good. I just need one part to swap in it, and it's perfectly good. I need to get somewhere safer and go through all this stuff. Ah, this is fucked. Surprised, like, pop this guy in the head. Oh, another SVD. Look at that. No, SKS is 7.62x39, aka, uh, AKM round. That is an incredibly good SKS. Holy shit, man. That's almost perfect condition. But you have too much stuff, I can't carry it all. What am I gonna do? G36 is excellent condition. Uh, I can leave some of this crap. I'm gonna go put some stuff in a stash over here. If I don't get shot while doing it. So crap right now. Ah, it's not low enough for that. I still need a cleaning kit for this. Damn it. There's no traders like anywhere. Yeah, it had a suppressor as well. I need to get somewhere safe and figure out my loot situation. I think these are UNISG guys, they have excellent gear. They're on some kind of op in the zone. Who would win? Three operators versus one cheeky breaky. The answer may surprise you.
That is 69%. Nice. They're both 69%, 1% too low to use my cleaning oil. God damn it. I use sleeping pills to get into the sci field. I don't feel safe here. I don't think I should be eating and drinking here. I need to go sleep. At least my psi health is recovered. Safe. Uh, let's try to go to the sleeping over here. This little camp. I see people. Bandits. It's only on like some guns. Uh, there's not really any perfect solution. It's a X ray engine problem. You could do super sampling. <laughs> that helps a little bit, but not a, not a ton. But there's no good TAA implementation into X-Ray Engine, so probably not any good solution. Cool. No! Why game crash? Ooh, magazine error. What magazine scripts? Attempted to compare with nil stack trace. That's an actual magazine crash, obviously. That's the first, though. That's unfortunate. One of those mags is broken, I think. That's the first today, at least, in one hour. <laughs> uh, that's such as life when you have so many add-ons. Not Anomaly's fault. Oh yeah, I'm recording the VODs now in 4K, my native resolution. So all the highlights in the YouTube channel are going to be in 4K. Are you hyped? Are you excited? So which one of this is it? It doesn't really say. So many pixels. Okay, no crash this time. Weird. cleaning kit for my gun. 72p, gang. What more could you possibly need? Let's be honest. Well, we got control of the bar. I could head back. It's gonna be a pain to haul that good all those goodies there, though. Watching it on your iPod uh, video. Nice. stuff that I left. No OG P3 player? Oh. So you're not embracing the future, which is 
like iPod video. I see. You Luddite. There's definitely a difference, Neo Bear, but the real reason I did that is for the different resolution scaling, which I talked about yesterday. Scaling the stream from 1440p to 1080 is not an even scaling. Uh, 4K to 1080p is exactly one fourth, so the stream actually looks better. That is the primary reason of getting it. That plus I can mirror my uh, my TV, which is, most TVs are 4K nowadays, and that uh, without having to change the scaling on my main monitor. It is really tough to run games in 4K, even for a 2080 Super. But I'm running this in 4K right now. I got 50 FPS, so it's definitely playable. Plus the G-Sync helps a lot. Like it does, I don't even feel like I'm getting under 60. Well, they're just getting cheaper and cheaper, Neo Bear. I wouldn't have paid an exorbitant price for a 4K monitor. But I was either going to get a 1440p monitor, uh, 240 hertz, or a 4K 120 hertz. And they were about the same price, so I went for the 4K for the, the scaling. I feel like if you have a 3080 or a, like a 3090, 4K is totally doable for most games. 2080 Super, I feel like, is doable, but right, kind of right on the border. Hey, what's up, a Berkey? Four K thirty. Oh yeah, thirty FPS. Anything sucks. I wouldn't have got a four K monitor if I couldn't have got at least one hundred twenty hertz, which those are just starting to become affordable now. They're getting better at making panels. Plus, if you don't even want to use the four K, this this monitor at least has better scaling, so I can turn the resolution down and it still looks pretty decent. My old monitor, which was kind of like the cheapest possible two K monitor. If I turned it anything but the native resolution, it just looked like trash. Could not run games at 1080p because it just the pixelation and like shimmering was just unbearable. And you can also turn off uh, GPU resolution scaling, so it'll just be like letterboxed with a lower resolution. And yeah, you don't need anti-aliasing on 4K really. I literally like, can't see the pixels on my monitor, no matter how close I get. Oh, it's actually really impressive. I'm getting like my eye as close as possible. I can't see any grid or anything. Oh, wow, that's actually impressive. I've never done that on a 4K monitor this small. The pixel density is nuts. That fucking sucks, Zed Flames. I've never had a dead pixel on a monitor before. At least on a 4K monitor like this, if I was one dead pixel, you're probably not even gonna notice. Yeah, once 4K gets more and more standardized and cheaper to produce panels for and graphics cards get better and better, it's going to become standard, I think. Like 1080p was years ago. There are always be the people who are like, okay, now it's 16K is the new thing, but it's just like, that's going to be so long before GPUs can get that strong. At least like 10, 20 years. What am I doing? I need to go see a trader. I have these two guns, which are just below the percentage to be able to repair. It's what it says 70.
I couldn't do that before. It's, it was 69 before, now it's 70. What? I mean, I ain't complaining. Rounding errors, yeah, I guess so. Nice. Don't have a scope for it, unfortunately. But uh, still a really good rifle. I got ammo for it too. Hundred percent. Two max for it. Fucking god damn it, game! Same crash. It keeps happening. One of these mags is bugged, I think. Don't worry about it, Lurko. <laughs> That's how you clean guns in the, the zone. You drink the gun oil and then it passes through your body and your piss cleans uh cleans cleans the gun. It's true. Another pro tip for me. Free of charge. <laughs> What's up, Pablo? I will keep getting away with this. Yeah, totally try that in real life. Totally. By the way, I'm not a doctor. This is parody. For legal reasons. If you could do that, Ventar, I would hugely appreciative. It's a whole new, whole new meaning, the golden shower, it's true. Uh, that's 80 and up, that's 65. Oh, that's actually really good oil. Wait, what? When did that get so good? Shit, I need to use that for the G36. It's always been good. Really? Have I just been sleeping on that? Shit. Hell yeah. It's the last of my cleaning oil, but still. Looking for an experienced stalker to lead me to Chuck Center around the army warehouses east of the Freedom Base. Name's Zenka Head. Might go do that for him. Not a ton of ammo for this, unfortunately. Got one mag, but it'll be reliable. It's not doing great. I didn't want it to fully load, actually. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, there There we go. Five. 
And then load the three hollow points. Load the two AP. There we go. That's what I wanted. Oh, I had one still spare in there. Cool. Didn't realize there was one in there. They don't sell for very much mask unless you change the price for them because you buy them for like a hundred rubles or something it's like basically nothing so they won't they'd sell for like 10 15 rubles not even really worth the effort unless you're wanting to make them more expensive which you're making them more expensive to buy too so it's a trade-off uh okay dokey my pistols mags are all good so sleepy. I need to sleep. A long day's rest and some R&R. &R. my water go? Canned beef, a luxury in the zone. От природа, ёп, шмотки походу обсохнуть не успевают. Ноги постоянно мокрые. I'll do that, Demi. Next time I update uh, my mods, I'm not doing it right now. Uh, okay. All right. This doesn't have a proper scope on it. Fuck. What's that mod that adds the alternate aim? Doesn't that add a proper G36 scope when you change the alternate aim? Because this red dot sucks. Does anyone know that mod? Fortunately, no. I swear there was a mod that did that. Someone specifically told me about that, unless they were mistaken. None of them added undersigned to that. Really? Is there a mod that just changes it to like a like a 2D scope like when you zoom in? Yeah, I thought it was here. It doesn't have the undersight. Yeah. Wait, okay. You didn't know we had a Discord, Pablo? Really? After all this time? Exclamation point Discord. Need to make it compatible with EFT mod. Oh, no. We talk about it all the time, though. Ah, yeah, get in there, Pablo. Of course. You have to do a verification thing, which is basically link like a YouTube account or something. Keeps uh, alternate accounts and trolls out of it. It's done a fantastic job, but it is kind of a, a hoop you have to jump through. Well, that's annoying, because I hate the red dot on this thing. Like, it's like dirty and like so thick around it. It's terrible. I might use the SKS or the uh, SV. Hopefully, it doesn't crash on me again. No, this is anomaly, bro. We're not playing area anymore. It's kind of kind of miserable. Oh, we got three mags for this. Nice. Can't I add that one to loadout? Weird. 
We got a ton of old AP rounds. Cool. That's clearly the green dot. Shut up! You know what I mean! I'm not sure what's causing the weapon lowering. I think the EFT mod doesn't have it in properly. Because I'm not using any other mod other than that, and I replaced it, so I thought it would uh, be resolved, but apparently not. WPO causes it? Really? Why would that cause it? That's, I wouldn't expect that. There we go. In defiance at LTX. Oh, that's the thing uh, you sent to me the other day that I'm supposed to fix. Fuck it, let's fix it right now. That's a single fix. Let's do that real quick. Uh, I'm not going to play this old Azazel save. So I'm going to overwrite that. Isn't there a max hatch of WEO? Yeah, I'm using it. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm going to turn on the uh, intro so you have something to look at. Do, 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 do. Yeah, WPO mags patch is installed. That changes, that defines that LTX, right? So I need to open up the defines.ltx. Um. Right, I made the merge with the EFT weapon changes to Right, I need to make a merge of these other ones. Right, 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 right. Okay. Do this real quick. Compare these two files. Man, I really sh I should make a new folder with this, but I'm so lazy. There, lowered HUD offset. Yeah, it should be like point. F yeah, okay, I've got that right there. Yeah, so that's what was different between them. And I've got the uh, magazine anti jam. Right. Okay. Done. Thank you. I thought like I was gonna have to go through each file for each gun and fix that. I was just like. Oh no. Oh no. And while we're here, let me uh I wanna get uh RZ's radiation overhaul. Ooh, there's some new stuff here. Oh shit. Oh no, here we go again. <laughs> Someone added the uh, the bandit guy with the teeth from the Stalker Two uh, showcase to uh, as an icon for uh, characters. <laughs> it's a hey, what's up? Time for pets. Okay. Um. Let's see. Uh, we'll go through last updated. Oh, Ventar put out some updates. 
for uh, Warfare A Life. I need to get that real quick. I'll update that real quick. Should just be a quick swap. Got the radiation overhaul. I fix the weapon lowering. Uh, new version of NPC loadouts. Oh, new version of weapon parts overhaul. Let me see what the change log is. And I think that's all that's new from... Uh, It's not that important to update Warfare Overhaul. Warfare Air Life Overhaul. Okay, so it's just a tiny little change. Not really relevant. Okay. Thank you for doing for telling me that. It saves a little bit of time. Okay, cool. This uh, rebalance squad loadout has got a big update. Connecting my Steam, I'm in the server now. Just updating mods, fixing some stuff. You're in the uh, you're in the Discord, Pablo. Pablo, there you are. Verification started. It says it hasn't gone and finished. I can just bypass it for you. I know I know you're cool. Bypass. Pablo. There we go. I just bypassed it for you, so you don't have to do anything. I forgot that I can just do that. Well, then Pablo's playing the long con, and he deserves it. <laughs> if he's played us that hard, then that's fine. I'll deal with the consequences. The same with Berkey, playing the long con. Uh, okay. Sorry, let me try to focus. Um, does this require a new game? Does the radiation overhaul absolutely require a new game? Nice mask. Okay. I don't know. It says on the on the top page it says read the description carefully before you start a new game. So it's like, uh, does it require that? Uh, NPC loot update got an update. Does it actually work now? Oh, this is Ventar. I haven't seen the... Uh, I didn't realize you made this add-on, too. You make some good shit, man. Uh, does this uh, NPC loot claim? I've been haven't seen it actually work at all in my game. From what you've seen, have I just not been in a situation? One warning: if you use Michiko's weathers, the radiation zones will always be huge. Okay, maybe I'll disable Michiko's weathers. 
companions are exempt from the system. I mean, I've had games where I was not with the companions, so I didn't notice them do it, but I'm not sure. Um, let's see. Okay. WPO uh, update is just Russian translation fixes, so no, not relevant to me. I haven't played a ton with it, though, Ventar, so I don't know if I'm just haven't been in the proper situation. But I'll update it and we'll see. Works very well, my guy. Okay, so it may just be situational. Okay, y'all. Uh, give me just one minute. Let me extract these mods and then we'll be restarting. Uh, Rowan, 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 Rowan. Squad loadouts. Oh, that's cool. Better army NPC loadouts. Strong army NPC loadouts. What's the difference? It's the difference between strong and better. <laughs> oh, geez. Shrips army of surplus World War II weapons. Only modern SVT and SKSs. Standard equipment for novices. Okay, strong is better than better. Strong is better than better. I'll probably do better armed soldiers then, because that's it's weird that they carry like pistols and shotguns. Okay, so the main, put that in there. And I'll just put this in the main folder as well. Better is tier one, so put that. Or tier two. Place. Okay. And that's that. And let me just update NPC claim loot. NPC claim loot main. Here we go. Optional better loot. What is this? Uh, what are your settings? Because I have my own custom settings that I use. For Okay, a lot of variation in the outfits and such. Ammo values seem about the same as what I do. More item drops, though. I need, I need to make a custom or someone... I don't really have the time to. I wish I did. Uh, a merge with the body health add-on to add proper medical items to NPCs, so like that they would actually simulating that they would actually be using the stuff. Okay. More item drops that like flashlights and meds. Okay, I'll give it a shot. I mean, it looks very similar, but more meds seems nice. I feel like monolith and like mercs and stuff have crazy amount of stuff, but everyone else doesn't have anything. PC claim loot optional, better loot. Oh, that's not the name. My OCD. One is called NBC loot claim, and one's called NBC claim loot. I messed up. Unacceptable. Absolutely unacceptable. Okay. Alright. Done and done. Restart the mod configurator. Gamergate was back in 2013. Damn, I had just graduated high school when that happened. I barely remember. All right, better loot. That's, of course, going to conflict with my other patch. That's fine. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm doing a lot of stuff right now that I've kept trying, I'm remembering that I wanted to do. Let me separate my better textures mods. 
so I can get the better sky textures. I feel like that's one of the most drastic one, and it shouldn't affect my frame rate much at all now that I'm running 4K. Because it's all in one folder right now. Better textures, better sky textures. Go. So don't, maybe you could uh, try to see which ones are the most. Probably the world textures are the most, um, most demanding. So maybe not the weapons, the skyboxes. We'll try those. The mutants and we'll try like half and half and see how it affects the frame rate. So I think it's just overwhelming my VRAM. It's kind of weird that the 2080 Super only has eight gigabytes. I feel like it should have more. So I've regularly get close to the max with like 4K and games and stuff. Weapons, Skybox, Mutants, and Stalkers are what we got. Weapons, Skyboxes, Mutants, Stalkers. Amazing Atheist has gotten better over the years. He's not a chud anymore. Still kind of a contrarian, but he's not that bad. He's changed a good bit. I didn't even realize that he had gotten better until I watched him like last year talk to Vosh, which I don't really watch Vosh anymore, but he seemed all right. He was definitely very chuddy in the back, but it seems like it was born of ignorance rather than bigotry, which is the case a lot of times. It's kind of hard to tell the difference sometimes, though. He still has some dumb takes on Twitter. I'll say that. <laughs> Just like, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, Jack. Yeah, he was in that anti-SJW kind of pre-2016, around 2016 kind of kind of person. But instead of going full on, full on fashy, he went more social democratic. I don't know if he's really like a socialist, but. He's on the left. Part of the dirtbag left, I guess. My favorite YouTuber is Chowder. <laughs> Steven Chowder. That's all right. You can be a liberal. I might tease you a little bit, but you're a lot better than some people. Louder with shouter. Yep, that's it. Okay, all good now. Oh, wait, let me restart the uh, mod launcher. Enable part of the better textures. We're going to test and see how well that runs. Let's go. Should I delete shader cache? New textures? I'm gonna go ahead and do it, can't hurt. Oh, uh, just remembered something. One second. Sorry. Interruptions after interruptions after interruptions.
All right. Working. Let me turn off preview so it's not affect frame rate. Okay. This is I don't even remember. I might spawn in a Geiger counter so we can figure out how to get back into uh, the radiation overhaul because it makes it way more difficult dealing with radiation. Oh, was I talking while loading again? I'm never going to remember that. Frame rate still seems solid. And probably just the world textures that were causing the frame drops. That is most of the textures. Okay. Um, wait, let me check if I have Michiko's weather still enabled. I disabled so many things. Okay, no, not enabled current, so it doesn't want influence uh, radiation overhaul. And let's get a Geiger counter so we can figure out how this works, because it's going to be a big change. I know, I know, cheating again. Uh, does it not tell me a number anymore? Is that intentional? <laughs> I don't know. Is that a bug? Oh wait, I see the number now. Wait, what? Is it because it's zero? I think it's a bug. Well, the lighting is just being weird with it. When I go inside, it fades away. Screen clearing. I don't know. <laughs> Why is it darker inside? I don't know. Sigs and vodka don't help with Raz. Got it. But yeah, ra Raz doesn't like just drain your health. It's more of a long-term problem, right? I'm trying to remember when I back when I played with this mod. Uh oh, wait. Let's see if the fix. Yeah, fixed. Mag loaded. All right, where are we going? Gonna head back to bar, right? Got a little bit of money. Yeah, a good amount of money. I need to talk to uh, I need to talk to a mechanic. Get more cleaning stuff. I need to get a proper gas mask too. For real. It's the best we got right now. <laughs> because it's like. 2% radiation resistance. Better than nothing, I guess. Oh god, I can't see anything. <clears throat> Will the Geiger counter go off when I'm near radiation? Should probably work now, right? And I can't remember what the command is to show your rad levels on the HUD. I think it was Dimeen who told me that, but I don't remember, uh, remember what the command is. Hey, what's up, Ziggy? I'm doing good. How about yourself? Trying out some new mods. He's got RZ's radiation overhaul. The update just came out. Eight is rads. Ah, there we go. Thank you, thank you, y'all. Nine is win. Okay. Nine doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh, shit. 
you rads. Ah, uh, rad zones. The Geiger counter's not going off. Fuck. Nice. You're, you're a bandit. We're good. Cool. Battery's got full batteries. So just, it's got it. Oh yeah, you're, oh they're the same guy that I led over here. You uh, made your way over here. Uh, should I take anti rads? Minus 138 for 11. No, that gives me like 1500 anti rads. It's kind of a waste. Is my health going down quickly? It is going down. Really? Already? I thought it was supposed to go down slower than that. Something is weird. I'm not supposed to get warning icons about rats. Hold up. Did I... I know what the problem is. Right, we're just gonna reload the save because I know it's I know it's wrong. Uh, typically, when you're installing mods, uh, it does help when you actually install them. Uh, usually, though, sometimes it'll work without that, but uh, you have to keep an eye out for uh, mods that require you to actually install them. I didn't even download it? What the fuck? Oh no, not the vodka. Okay. So yeah, uh, with this mod, RZ's Radiation Overhaul, uh, you actually have to uh, download it and it put install it into your game if you want it to do anything. Uh, it's a common mistake to make, you know? Just by looking at it, it doesn't usually install. RZ radiation overhaul. Really? Yeah, I know. A lot of people don't know that. <laughs> okay. Now that I actually have it installed. <laughs> Enable, what does it conflict with? Patch for fast travel plus warfare. Game fast travel script. Okay, it conflicts slightly with that. I'm gonna disable the patch then, so it might have some issues later on. Uh, it conflicts with attachment overhaul, which probably changes devices, right? Items, attachments, yeah, and thirst. So yeah, it's not compatible with attachment overhaul, which I'll just disable that right now. I really use the radiation. Maybe make a maybe make a compatibility patch another time. Okay. Okay. Doesn't why do you get cancer in real life? Damn. That's next level immersion. EFT saw weapon repositions crashing my game? Oh, that's weird. I don't know why it would do that. Maybe something else is requiring a file and it's overwriting it. Time to rave. You can let attachment overhaul overwrite radiation overhaul. But wouldn't that change how thirst works with thirst overhaul? Radiation overhauls edit to attachment. It's just very minor edit to minus rats. Okay, so let me do that real quick then. Just gotta press a button. Okay. Oh yeah, Gallus view models is completely incompatible. Time to raise. That's for uh, position and view. You don't want to use that. EFT is a replacement completely for position and view. Cements view models. It's they do they do the same thing but differently. Attachment overhaul includes a patch script for thirst. Does it? 
I didn't remember seeing that. Whatever. I'm just gonna. Yeah, I just got it installed, window. Actually installed this time. Uh, at the very bottom, uh, time to rave, you can just a search thing. It's like filter or a sort or something like that. It's a little line where you can type in the search. Okay. I think it's working now? We'll see. Get a PSO scoop for this guy. All right, we'll put this on for the small percentage of better radiation protection. Let's see. No rats. I guess it's because it changed all the radiation zones. The one that's permanently here is no longer here. Oh, right. Uh, if it's storming and raining, that affects the radiation. I'm trying to remember how it affects it. Usually dry wind is very dangerous to radiation. But if it's storming, does that mean it's less? I can't remember. There's so many complex changes. Rains and storms is less. Gotcha. So that's a good reason to move around in storms now. Bad for hearing, good for radiation. Oh, right. I forgot about all this. Jesus. No, I don't think it ever snows. There's the mods for Anomaly that make it snow. Yeah, time to rave. It's they're completely separate mods. They do the same thing. So it's whatever one you prefer. I, I'm right now. I'm preferring the EFT mod because it makes the weapons smaller. Lurkers. Oh God. Hard to aim. They're taking that off. Oh yeah, that's so fucking cringy. No, I don't have that mod on mask. They're not that hard to aim right now, so I never really had the need to. As long as you run sideways at the right time, they like never hit. That's what makes boars so dangerous is that they actually don't leap at you, they just run at you and hit you. Same with cats. I don't think I need anything to make mutants even easier. They're already too easy. No, I don't have that mod Neo Bear. I meant to get that, but uh I didn't want to add too many things to the mod list. Yeah, that fixes the SVD rate of fire, right? Hey, what's up, Enyo Nomad? Thanks for the raid. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Trying out some new mods right now. We just got RZ's radiation overhaul. Just got an update. 
really, really cool mod. I've been waiting for that one to update. Completely changes how radiation works in the game. Ah, uh, cool Neil Bear. Yeah, I need to get that then. I'll get that another time. We spent enough of, <laughs> enough of the stream already doing uh, bug fixes and modding. I haven't had any issues, Nomad. I've heard uh, Michiko's weather overhaul has trouble with it, but I don't have that currently running. And uh, attachment overhaul has had issues, but it, it really depends on what you're running. Uh, mechanic is here. What's up? Uh. What happened to my gun? What? What happened to it? I shot like six times. Is this like to reload a save before I cleaned up my gun? Is that what happened? It was prefixed. Oh, I just I didn't mean she. No, because I loaded these magazines after I fixed it. No. No, that doesn't, the timeline doesn't work out. That's a, something happened. Oh, right. Uh, you use Boom 6 and Sharp 6. I don't use, uh, I use that. I don't use it because of the compatibility issues of everything. Acid rain? Oh, is there acid rain and that's what's causing it? Let's test it. Is that a thing? Choking with you? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. Now that's the same percentage. Yeah. There is extra durability damage in the rain. It's kind of weird, but... Wow, that goes down a lot. What? 6% for each shot? What? What? That's broken. That's that's very broken. That's very broken. What is causing that? <laughs> it's on the WPO patch notes. The uh, rain thing. Well, it stopped raining, so I think that fixed that. Let me make sure it's not. Oh yeah, no, it's not the rain. I don't remember that ever happening with any other gun. Is that just the SVD? This is 73. It's just the SVD. I think the SVD is broken. Only got some slightly scratched parts. It shouldn't be anything internal. I don't not using an SVD fix, no. Bad bullets. It is old ammo, but it shouldn't cause it that much. Unless it's a uh, like that's what's causing the bu uh, the bugged behavior is the old ammo. It'll reduce it. I mean, increase the wear and tear slightly, but not that much. Um, let's let me try it. Let me get uh, some proper ammo and test it. Um, ammo. So it's sixty by five four. The L85 experience. <laughs> Britain's finest. All right, let's see. 63. Oh, yeah. It was the old ammo causing that. It shouldn't be that high. It should be, like, double wear and tear, but not, like, 6% for each shot. <laughs> that seems bugged. That seems very bugged. 
Is the ammo like exploding in my gun? I mean, yes, that's how ammo works. But is it like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. When I use old ammo, Daimene, with my SVD, it goes down by 6% durability for each shot. Not working properly, I think. <laughs> Not working properly. Well, let me... I'm going to fix up my gun real quick. Well, it didn't damage the internals, did it? It did damage the internals. I'm going to do the save. <laughs> is it exploding in my gun? It's like almost there's like a fire inside the barrel and melting it. That's crazy. <laughs> okay, internals are still fine now. Let me, uh... I'm gonna have to spawn and replace my old ammo for now. Unless someone can find out the source of that problem. There's no way that's intentional. It's... It's way too extreme. Maybe it was damaged ammo or something, but I've never seen it go that much, uh, that heavily degrading anything for anything else. Um, ZH1 is standard ammo, right? Confirmed. It's normal. It's normal for it to go down by 6% for each shot. That's intentional. I'm confirming that with you, because that sounds outrageous. Congrats, French Broken Doll. Happy 20. Let the zone take me if I'm lying. What the fuck, Grok? Why? <laughs> Make that shit optional. That's insane. Because you have to change up every other balance now. Because I have it with my, like, the loot balances where you get mostly old ammo. And you, now you just can't ever use old ammo. Like, never, ever, ever. Like, that's a disaster. Unless you want to, like, clean your gun every, like, three shots. Hey, Eternal Inquisition. Uh, going pretty good. We're just, uh, discovering new ways for modders to Did fuck us in the ass. Exciting times. Exciting times. Uh, I need a cleaning kit? Large bore? Yeah. Where was before. Uh, check ammo. Okay, so I guess I'll just for now. I'm just gonna swap all my old ammo with standard ammo. Hey, thank you, Ignis Floor, for the tier one sub two months in a row. Much appreciated. Good to be giving me my money. Thank you. I really appreciate. It. It's old AP ammo right now. That's extremely case specific. So AP, old AP ammo. Hmm. Well, let's try old standard full metal jacket ammo. I want to see if it's fine if I use that. Even if it's like one percent every shot, if like that's punishing, that's still punishing. But that's like I can at least get a magazine off <laughs> without having to fix my gun. It should be like half percent, but. Uh, ammo. 76 by CH1. It's. Is it that? 
Yeah. No, that's not the right ammo. I need. Yeah, that's not. I need ZN1 rounds. Why don't I see it on the list? There it is. I'm just blind. Yeah, uh, we've seen it. Air spread. Pretty cool. Nothing too crazy, though. Because uh, you're blind. I mean, it, it, I am blind. It's true. Does this have a bullet loaded in it? Okay, no, that's not how that works. That'd be cool if it did, but... Can't be so lucky and everything. Okay. So we're at... 100%. Still 6%. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I'm gonna have to make a custom fix for that, Grok, because, good lord. I think it's already, like, what is the deg degradation? Is that one? I can set it to 0.5. Yeah, that does cut it in half, I guess. Still, it's not, I wouldn't want to use that 3% every shot. Still can't get a mag off without going down to 70. Yeah, that's 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 way over over changed. That's that's too much. I strongly disagree with that being how it is. I was gonna turn it back up to one, and we're just gonna get rid of our old ammo. Okay, so yeah, we've got old ammo loaded right now. I mean, I've got a mod that changes all the loading tips though, with just like quotes and like lore specific stuff. So it's not really a, it's not really a thing. Uh, okay. It's fine, I mean, we tested it, it's normal, it's not... It doesn't degrade it. Let's well, check the SVD just to be sure. Hundred or ninety nine. Ninety nine. Yeah, that's three shots with nothing, so that's normal. Takes quite a bit of ammo for that to go down. Okay. Uh, where were we? <laughs> oh, yeah. Get rid of all the AP. Got good ammo loaded. Okay. This guy's just been yelling at me the whole time. Uh, trade. I would like to get, uh... Fix up my Makarov. 70 and up so I can get some spray oil. That'll be fine. But I also maybe should look for another suit. I feel like I can replace this pistol. It's not I don't feel like spending three thousand. You know, yeah. Uh have we taken the whole bars? Rostock duty base. Have we Is there enemies over here? This whole time? Yet to 
take the duty base for the uh, trader to respawn. And no, it looks like no one's here. If uh, you're talking to Grok, uh, Daimene, or Ventar, uh, can you just ask him to make it optional? Like, have it be modular? Because I really don't enjoy that. Yeah, bet. Like, damage damage on vanilla and almond is only 30% faster, and that's damaged. Alright, do we have. Trader now? Will we need this point too? I still don't know what Ad Influence does. Uh, maybe someone told me. Ah! What? There are duty guys in there! Holy shit, I yelled so loud. I was not expecting duty guys to just be hanging out in here. God, I can't believe how loud I yelled. That I fucking leaped. I like I, I think I got air in my seat slightly. I jumped so bad. <laughs> Hopefully my uh, limiter and compressor did okay there, where I didn't absolutely melt your ears. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> I've got all my stuff still. I mean, I guess it's fine. Whatever. Wait. Oh, everything fixed itself? Oh, that's broken. Uh oh. Uh oh, that's broken. Uh, I don't know about that. That's not intentional. I'm going to reload the save so that doesn't happen. Because nothing really changed. I would just get all my loot back, but better. That's... No ear melting? Okay, good. Then my, I set up my compressor and such uh, properly. Yeah, that's a great exploit. I don't... I unintentionally did that exploit. Yeah. metagaming a little bit here. I'm going to throw all the stuff in here in case I die again so I don't get it all back. Perfect condition. I legitimately, I don't think I've ever yelled that loud while playing the game. That was like a real yell. That wasn't like a panicking, like, yelp. That was like a that came from the, the gut. Fuck, I threw my magazine in here. This is kind of jank, but I'm just going to do this. I don't feel like going through all the loot trying to rebalance it so I don't have the good stuff with the exploit. Kind of defeats the purpose of Azazel, but... This is a weird situation. Now I'm getting fucking impatient.
Slow down, Solar. These guys are for real. Goddamn hardcore AI aim is fucking for real. This is like impossible. I did fine like that first time. Now I just can't kill him. As soon as I left cover to change my peak to a right peak, he popped out and just fucking insta wrecked me. Die, please. Die, please. Thank you. Goodbye. I don't have AP ammo. And they do. So hard to use iron sights. So hard. It really is a very defensible position. Never actually had a fight in here and have it actually be difficult. Okay, well that was weird. Kind of a fucked up situation. Very scuffed. We're just gonna we're just gonna ignore those save reloads. Yeah, I don't have any grenades. But I should have some decent stuff now. Maybe I'll get a rifle. One of these guys is an AK-12. Which is a very good gun. Rare, too. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Perfect condition. No wonder. These guys were like elites. Holding the line in here. Foul too. That's kind of broke, but their squad leader had the best stuff. Hell yeah. AK-12 is so good. It's got a grenade launcher on it too. Holy shit. I never get to use the AK-12. Hog. Hack sleuths. Yep, I, I'm a hacksaw. Uh, this is... Yeah, this thing's fucked. Fix up one of these helmets. The uh, M12 is better, right? Telfish from there. Um, AK-12. I should be able to use both these mags, right? They're not loaded, so I guess I can't find out. ACOG uses 3D scope with each position. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, it's going to take my frame rate when I'm only getting, like, 60. It'd be cool to see, though. The traitor spawned them. Not yet. Uh, any recommended mods? Vanilla Call of Pripyat? I think Call of Pripyat is mostly fine vanilla. You did Shadow Noble Blind uh, vanilla, right? It's picture in picture. 
uh, Newberry, I think, so it's going to tank my frame rate, but it'd be cool to see. But there's no traitor here yet, so we'll have to hang around for a while. 3D, not picture. I thought it was picture in picture. Must be misremembering then. Get that fixed up. Get a new armor set. Get some ammo. Can't use all old rounds at all. Not at all. Oh yeah, Charkov's 3D scopes look fucking phenomenal. And somehow they do it with no frame drops either. At least that I ever noticed. Must work separately than just doing double rendering. I'm not sure how that works, but it's cool. Helmet repair kit. Ah, it's like all my money though. That's not going to be enough for an armor set, so might as well just get this fixed up. It'll give me some armor. Uh, I don't have any modifiers. Shaders are the key to picture in picture. Okay. Shaders just seem like fucking magic. I don't understand it. Shit's crazy. That's how, like, uh, Half Life Alex did the fluid physics in the bottles. Just shaders. It's fucking nuts. Oh, I can't even use that. Oh, just blue and repair kits. Or, no, that's the wrong thing. Uh, Alright, the ball peen hammers. Which you do have. Cool, cool, cool. There's a stalker mod that was showing off zero frame hit mod of magnifying shader. How the fuck? Is that like, it's gotta be like through engine edits and stuff, right? There's no way that's just like an add-on. Oh man, I wish Anomaly had that. That would be so fucking cool. I need some food and water and we need to sleep for a few days so we can have bandits move in, take over. New traders. I hope ray tracing becomes more and more popular over the years, because you can do some really cool stuff with it. Not just like fancy lighting, but like interesting like mirror and like light mechanics and like lenses. Oh, I meant to stream it, but uh blowout? I didn't hear the uh, the crows. Maybe that's not working properly. Maybe I didn't install it. We should have some new blowout sounds. It's supposed to have crows cry out for a blowout as a warning. We'll get to hear the new uh, sounds. It sounds like they're working. Can 
I make it to the mechanic? I probably can. Yeah. I always under or overestimate how quick blowouts happen. Tooth generator in Stalker 2. Pretty interesting new anomaly type. This anomaly type creates British people. It's kind of disgusting, but... <laughs> in all seriousness, it adds uh, it's a cool variety. Nothing crazy, but it's just like model variations. Get some unique people. You know, like never see teeth that often, so it's kind of... It's kind of... Uh, not like a super cool thing, but a cool little detail. It's probably a system, like part of a overall system of variation, but they just had that finished. It's not a, probably a ton of work that required to go into that. Don't get so political, Pablo. Are these sounds different? seem the same. Maybe a little quieter? Let me see if I actually installed it. Oh god, I didn't actually even install it. God damn it, how do I keep forgetting to install mods? God. Fuck. I'm just gonna install it right now. I wanna hear what it sounds like. I don't, I, I don't know. This usually doesn't happen. I'm usually able to remember and I'm, I'm sorry, babe. Usually I can perform. I, I don't know. I'm sorry. I didn't even download them. No, I did. I did download them. I just forgot to uh, extract them. Okay. I'm hitting the reefer. I mean, no, but I don't know. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm just like losing it. It's showing you have 10,000 viewers watching. I think that's bugged because it shows on. It doesn't update every like 60 seconds, but it says 145 for me. It's pretty average. Plus, I think chat would be fucking exploding if I had 10,000 viewers literally 100 times or 10 times. Oh, wait. Oof. Almost 100 times more people. Oh, boy. Today's not my day, is it? around age 27 people start shrink a shrinking brain well i'm 25 right now so that's a little early i may just be losing my sanity too much insight it's my 9,000 bots <laughs> i feel like twitch would notice if i suddenly had 10,000 viewers <laughs> Okay, I'm going to put both of these mods into one folder to save up on space. Keep the clutter down. I feel like it'd be very easy to make a bot that imitates standard arguments that go on in politics and Twitch chat. We've already thought about making a bingo card for my streams. Oh, these do the same thing, unfortunately. Surge manager. 
a Yeah, these have the same uh, changes have to be emerged. This is an optional file here. This is wider free time. Oh, that's a shame. So it changes the sound files too. Well, I'll do a, a merge real quick. It's only one config file, so. Shouldn't be difficult. Install the quieter version. So the video did seem a little too loud. I like Woman. Woman are pretty. Woman are soft. Me like Woman. Okay. Blowouts overhaul and blowout crows. Just got to edit the surge underscore manager. Whoa, man. Ha, ha. Get it? Whoa, man. It sounds like, like woman, like how it's spelled. You get it? <laughs> fucking, fucking funniest shit I've ever seen. Okay. Select for comparison. Compare with selected. I should show y'all what I'm doing. Let me do a little a learning experience. Make sure there's nothing incriminating on my desktop. No. So with uh, this is VS Codium. Absolutely fantastic program. Kind of a pain to get set up, but once you do, it's fine. So I have a there's a Add on to this called comparison. I remember you had another way to do it, but I'm not super familiar with this program. It's, it's really fucking complicated. It's used by programmers and such. People are way more smarter than me. Um, but I can select for compare, then right click the other one, compare with selected. And this will show you the difference with differences between the two files. And it'll show you on the right here where all these are. Th this on the right is just so fucking useful. So there's quite a few differences in this file. Missing a lot of stuff on this one. And I'm going to move the blowout overhaul files to the search, uh, to the crows mod. So I'm going to just copy paste all this. Uh, that should work. Did I paste that wrong? I think I pasted it wrong. Yeah, I fucked up the paste. Um. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, I know what I'm doing. Okay, I'm not overwriting that stuff too. There. And this, I didn't copy paste that right. Extra space. There. One more space here. There. See, there's no no compatibilities now. I moved all the lines from here to here. Uh, so the next one down here. That's the only difference there. What does that even do? I don't know, man. <laughs> okay, this is weird. I don't I don't know what this means. I'm just gonna. 
copy paste these parts and then see if it works. Yeah, what does the dash dash mean? Because it's the same otherwise. Come back to that. Uh, need some new files here. New lines. Dash dash is a comment note function. Okay, so they edited out that part. Okay. So that's with the blowout overhaul, that's something they edited out to change how it works. Okay. I should have had the other file where it's the vanilla so I can tell what's vanilla and what's not. So we'll just change all these. This might not even be changed by the crow mod. There's another factor that I didn't factor in. <laughs> So those are supposed to be commented out. I hope I'm doing this right. I don't know. I I never like to show this because it makes my brain not work as well. When I'm dedicating part of my uh my brain to commentary and streaming, it's hard to split that. I think that's part of the reason why. I have such bad stream blindness. It's because, you know, you're splitting your attention between looking at chat, paying attention to the game, playing the game, thinking about what to say. It's harder than you think, actually. I mean, it's not difficult to start or do, but to do it well, I think. I don't think I'm even that very good at it. Some, some I have better days than others, but... I feel like I guess I feel like when I'm doing I'm streaming alone, I think I do a pretty good job of filling the silence for the most part. Except when something intense is happening that I'm full focus on the game. I know the channels like uh Wooly Versus, they do a great job of like having interesting conversations like during the gameplay, during the slow time, but that's because there's two people in the same room talking to each other. <laughs> and I uh I don't talk to people in real life, so that's it's hard to do. <laughs> But I guess they also don't pay attention to chat nearly as much as I do. You're like the chat is the second person for the stream. It's not just me in my thoughts playing a game. That would be really fucking boring, I, I bet. Unless you're just really into the game. Okay, I think this should be everything. Yeah, Wooly's a fucking pro. Like he's I look up to him. He's very good at his job. They've been doing it for like a decade now, right? Since uh, two best friends, super best friends. Smart guy. Huge respect. I think the person I compare myself most to uh, is like uh, Beagle Rush. Probably the reason I started streaming was just watching him and uh, like just watching how he plays like XCOM and such. So comfy watching his XCOM streams. Um, like he's also he doesn't usually stream with other people. He's talking to chat. So I feel like they're very comparable. Um, I think I'm I think I'm pretty good. What I do. He's good as what he does. I think I'm actually yeah, I'm pretty good at that. Yeah, I'd say I'm good at that. Considering I think Beagle is really good at talking about what he's doing, talking about his strategies and stuff like that, trying to educate people. That's kind of what I try to do. I just realized how much I co directly copy how Beagle Rush does it. <laughs> like hearing him talk about XCOM and like the strategies, I'm like, oh yeah, that's that's a great way to talk about that. And then I, watching him for years, then coming in streaming Stalker has helped a lot. You learn from the best, you know? Yeah, Pat and Wooly are very different people. I love watching their podcasts um, just because they're so such different types of uh, people. They uh, Sometimes I feel like they grade on each other a little bit, but I know they, they're both... I bet they're both kind of weird dudes, so, you know, they 
they tolerate each other. Um, but yeah, Pat's very different. But watching him and like him and Paige play through a game where they're just like fucking with each other, holy shit! Like watching a. Uh, sorry, I'm just talking for a while, but watching Paige, uh, his wife, our fiance, uh, play through Portal One and Two. Holy, I don't think I've ever laughed that hard in my entire life. Because Paige is just like such a klutz. She's smart, but she's so... <laughs> she makes me look like I have 20-20 vision. She's so blind. Yeah, the Baba is you streams. Oh my god, I was losing my fucking mind. <laughs> Baba is you. Wall is you. Stalker is you. Stalker is loner. Loner is you. <laughs> Why you mean me? <laughs> Papa doesn't matter, you matter! They spent like 45 minutes. <laughs> How can this be? <laughs> God. Uh, they're a treasure. But yeah, they're Portal 2, 1 and 2 playthrough. Oh my God, I, I was literally out of breath laughing, like, hutched over the bed just from, like, hearing them, like, Pat trying to explain to her, like give her hints, and like her <laughs> just not seeing the most obvious way to move forward. <laughs> oh man, it's like I'm just laughing just remembering it now. Oh god. <laughs> Pat got the uh the uh Ah, oh, what's it called? The horn that's used in like music, like bow, bow, bow. you know what I'm talking about? When he got that to like, to, like guide her along the way. <laughs> oh my god! All right, all right, all right. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just I'm like I'm really like crying, laughing. It's like like I'm reliving the laughing fits. Oh. Okay, what was I doing? I fi I combined these mods, I fixed that. I'm just watching from watching other people stream. It's just <laughs> fucking hilarious. I wish I could be that funny. <laughs> no, it's it's good tears I am me. Good tears. I'm just laughing, just remembering the moments. This is so from watching uh, Peach Saliva on Twitch. Uh, her and Pat stares at uh, her fiance, which is from Two Best Friends Play. Them playing, or her playing Portal with him helping, giving her hints. Holy shit, go watch that. It's all on YouTube, on her ch uh, YouTube channel. It's fucking hilarious. Like, you're going to lose your mind, but you're going to laugh. Well, if you have similar... If you're watching me, you probably have similar type of humor as I do. So you'll probably fucking love it. Yeah, I have a Twitter. Should have a link on the Twitch channel, don't I? I've watched but no. <laughs> Thank you, Kitsune. Uh, because I hate myself, Neo Bear, that's why. I'm never gonna remember Neo Bear, I'm sorry. I don't know why it started doing that. Oh, I should go further back. The blowout might not happen. But I want to hear the, the crows at the beginning. New mission. Yeah, this is too early. This is definitely new sounds, though. Rishka Pepper. Ooh, the game is stuttering. 
Oh, I've got preview turned on. One sec. And display capture is still on. Yeah, that fixed that. Okay, I thought it was going to be mod. But can I make it to the, uh... Let's see. Oh, that is loud. I like these new sounds. A little too loud, I think, still. But I like it. like a slow motion nuke going off over the course of like 60 seconds. <laughs> you miss me laughing my ass off reminiscing among us. Try exclamation point mods. Or exclamation point anomaly, if you can hear me. It's fucking loud. It's not really loud for us. It's really fucking loud for me. I haven't turned down my 10 decibels in the stream, so... <laughs> You want to hear what it sounds like without reduced volume? Sure. Prepare your butthole. It's maxing out. Yeah. So, <laughs> that's what I'm hearing. What is that? Minus 9.4. I mean, it was literally maxing out the audio on the stream, so it can't get any louder than that in terms of, like, what I'm broadcasting. That actually, it's less loud than uh, the original blowout noises. The old blowout noises were, like, much more, like, white noise loud. Yeah, how'd you know, Bahungus? Oh, yeah, you take that. Yeah, we were, uh, we were sleeping, right? Oh, didn't Vintar say that, uh... It only takes... a few hours in-game for the traders to spawn? Is it because we don't have that point? And we have the duty base, right? I'll sleep for, like, two hours to see. For experience, I'm gonna leave it at Jupiter right now. I'm in raw stock. Yeah, I don't know about that, buddy. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Bring back the dead echoes during blowouts? What do you mean? You mean like the mutant sounds that you used to have? It's been a long time since I played. Like, Anomaly is just like overriding every. Okay. Ever overriding all my memories of other stalker mods. Like they could hear old distress over the radio. Oh, yeah, I kind of vaguely remember that. That would be cool. PDA is for you. Nice. You gotta sell those artifacts, but yeah, you actually have gear I can buy. I need 5.45. Holy shit, that's expensive. Alright, 
Time for a sell-off. Shadow Legends? What? <laughs> what the fuck are you over here? <laughs> you thought I said sell out. Sell out. Oh, that's a, an empty. It's a pretty good artifact, but I really need the money right now. I love reading these. Two discs of organic formation. Commonly lipids, cellulose, lignin? What's lignin? <laughs> With nothing but empty space in between. This is due to a unique gravitational field formed in the center that destabilizes the distance between, that stabilizes the distance between the discs. Any attempt to press the discs together or pull them apart will fail due to rapid positive negative changes in the gravitational field. As the artifact reacts to any physical power that breaks its balance. Because of this mechanism, moving with an empty is a hard task, as the gravitational field increases the density of surrounding air and slows the body down. The real usefulness of this effect comes with the ability to reduce friction, thus obtaining great protection against physical impacts. Radiation output is average. Cool. So it really creates a gravitational field around you that fucks with you but also fucks with bullets. Love, I love the description and anomaly for these. Very common in the zone. Gravitational artifact is able to slightly shield the body and objects against physical impacts. It will slightly protect its user against extreme heat produced respectively by fire anomalies. This artifact is quite heavy for the gravitational field. It seems to increase mass. Another downside is the artifact of the artifact is that it will increase the negative effects of psi waves and is a potential conductor. Output low. Radiation output low. Lignin is a uh, structural protein. Yeah, it sounds familiar, but I don't know if I was just remembering like Ligma and stuff. So. Wow, that is really good protection. Jesus. Fuck, I don't want to sell it, but I need to. How much would he give me for it? Oh, Six thousand! <sighs> Fuck you, man. That's like 60 rounds of ammo. Three thousand for that. That's more reasonable, I guess, compared. But Jesus, that's such horseshit. Fucking bandits. Fucking ripping me off. And I can't talk to the scientists because we're not friendly, so I don't really have a choice. <laughs> Zombify are the strongest squad. <laughs> Wait, what? Monolith has two squads. Zombies have 53. What? <laughs> Is it because of the blowout? What? Yeah, freedom. Maybe the freedom trader, our merc trader, will give me a better price for it. I bet the mercs would give me the best price. No, there's no way I'm selling that for 6k. Either of these. It's fucking dog shit. Oh, these prices are so bad. Yeah, I set it to Zombify, so it looks like it did that across the zone. Because <laughs> no one made it to a blowout. That's fucked. That's kind of cool, though. That's why I keep finding zombies, I guess. But maybe I should change that, because that seems a little broken. Because the AI doesn't do a very good job of making it. Uh, Missions... Kill as wave advances, kill at the end, explode.
Man, this, yeah, this economy is rough on survivalists. Yeah, that's why I said it to explode. I don't want to be able to get a bunch of free gear from the AI bugging out. Uh, fuck, man. Now what? I guess I have decent gear, at least. Not good armor, but... Get one of these pistols fixed up or something. Oops, I meant to uh, clip that. This one, auto pistol's pretty good condition. Ah, uh, all the internals are fucked on it though. It's got one good part in it. Crap. Crap. Yeah, that's fixable. That's uh, that's not a bad gas. You fix this one up. I'm gonna need a cleaning kit for it, but uh, that's definitely the cheapest to get fixed up. I just need a Western Spring assembly, which you have. I need a multi-tool. I'm probably gonna sell that pistol. Let me go, uh... Get a multi-tool. I can't afford it! Fuck! I'm gonna have to do some work if I'm gonna be able to get a... Get one. Try to fix up some of these gun. I can't fix up the gun without a multi-tool, though. Shit. I'm trying to think of what the best course of action is here. I might need to sell like one of those artifacts because I need the money that bad just to be able to get a multi-tool. But I wouldn't be able to... F Even if I do fix up the guns, what am I going to do after that? Can't afford a cleaning kit. I think I just need to do some work. I can sell off these. And... Uh, I want to hold on to that one. Everything else I'm just going to take the parts out and sell, I think. Yeah, pistol's not a big deal. Um, yeah. Let's uh, we'll go to the mechanic and uh, sell a bunch of stuff. Oh, you can't load ammo while walking. Oh, you can do it manually. <laughs> Immersion! That's not what I meant to do. Thank you for not letting me do that. More immersive than Tarkov. You have to actually move your hand to load the ammo. Incredible. That's... Well, that's exactly the situation I'm in, Neo Bear, so I guess that checks out. Uh... You can sell all this. That's not bad. Prices aren't terrible.
Every little bit adds up, I guess. Full Val Amp mag, nice. Oh, you actually just made that up, Neo Bear. I thought you took that from a like, like a Wicked like PDA or like a in-game PDA. Nice, nice job, actually. I've actually completely thought that was real. <laughs> Legitimately, I thought that you just copy-pasted that. Okay... Okay. Good to know, Ventar. I'll try to quick save before I accept any tasks. Thanks. 5k for a multi tool. Fuck! God damn it. Hey, Anomaly is incredibly stable when it's vanilla without add-ons. <laughs> when you've got 60 add-ons like I'm currently running, shit just kind of fucks up. But that is one bug that I guess it's still in Anomaly proper. Yeah, they don't really work on Warfare anymore. They're focusing on other stuff. But with your mod, Ventar, I've been enjoying it a lot more. I feel like it's a much smoother experience with your uh, add-on. I also have the spawn rate turned down now, so there's not, like, crazy groups of, uh, of stalkers everywhere. One thing I wish would happen is, uh, whenever you capture a point, instead of, like, just spawning people on top of it, they would spawn, like, a couple hundred meters away or something at a... <laughs> this fucking guy. At, like, another point, and they have to walk there instead of just teleporting. Because the teleporting really takes me out of it. Immersion ruin. I think Vanilla Anomaly is less buggy than Vanilla Stalker in any of the games. Which is a, an accomplishment. Honestly, I, mean, I don't want to... I wish I could turn off Azazel and I could just play like a proper run of this. Because I want to... See, like, the new mechanics from the new mods, but it's hard to see in Azazel. Because the fights are so deadly and it just ends. You're far away enough where you can't hear their footsteps and spawning in, but out of your field of view, too, that would work. Like, they were kind of, like, behind you moving up the whole time or something. That would be a decent solution, I guess. Um, yeah, we can sell all the old ammo. So we know not to use it. Hey, we got 5,000 for a multi-tool. Yay! I guess with Azazel, I can just reload save. But I got this cool gear with the AK-12. I'd never find an AK-12, so I don't want to just restart. I'll probably never find one again. Get rid of all this. No way to edit save file. Not that I'm aware of, no. I've already read all these. Cool. Sold half my inventory, got 5,000 rubles. Cool. Cool. I'm not going to bother with a multi-tool. I just need more ammo, I think. Yeah, 
doubt you have any scopes for sale. We're not running the trader overhaul anymore. Ooh, binoculars. I'm just short of those. I should get some of them. Uh, sell the 45 ACP. Ah, oh, so close. So close. Ooh, that's worth a lot. I could sell it to the medic. But man, look at that first aid. It'll heal my entire body, too. That's an incredible healing item. I just, it's, like, so good, though, I'll never, I want to save it and, like, never use it. <laughs> so I probably should just sell it. Why no trader overhaul? It was, because it, it has to be, uh, compatible with the mags and stuff, and there's probably some patches I had to install. I didn't go through the effort of... Trying to uh, get all the right patches and get it working right. Yeah, I've got the NPC claim loot and body, uh, body squat. Bounty squads. And, uh, turned on. Yeah, 3200 for that. That's as much as an artifact. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how that's going to work, Vincer. Sell VSK magazines. Interesting. And uh, I'm okay on meds, I think. I don't think it, I've got a decent amount. Yeah, Ventar has been putting the work in, making some good shit. I'm, I'm curious, Ventar, you could be honest. You know? Did you make the uh, NPC claim loot after I was talking about that on stream a few weeks ago, if you were even there? Because I was saying, like, man, I wish that was an anomaly, because other mods had it from, like, Faction Warfare and Clear Sky. Oh, thanks, Ventar. If there's anything, I find bugs pretty well. Sell that. 64 rubles. Um, binoculars. Nice. Cool. Could be the idea first came out months ago, but implementation was hard to get right. Ah, uh, gotcha. Yeah, I've been. It's something I bring up every once in a while because I try to play by house rules where I don't. God, grenades are twenty three hundred. I try to play by house rules where I don't like to steal loot, but it's you know it's. The temptation's always there, and sometimes I just say fuck it. But having it not be something I have to keep track of, and something that the game itself keeps track of is nice. Got a little bit of rats from that artifact. I mean, it's I got it from other mods, I didn't come up with it. It's I remember the Clear Sky The Faction War, or is it mod? Had that. That was the first time. I, that was the only time I've ever saw it, and it was really well implemented. Where you can like do like a almost like a charisma check. If you're like friends with someone, they're like, "All right, or we can split it." That's cool stuff. Where it was already in a mod for anomaly. I never remember that Neo Bear. I don't think so. Okay. Um, no scope, unfortunately. Scopes are high value items. But uh, at least have a helmet. Maybe get like some glue, fix up the helmet, top it off. And then. Um, let me load my magazines. There's a string enable Azazel mode in the .scoc save file. I mean, that seems like exactly what you're looking for. How did you uh, open it? What, what uh, editor? Using HXD? Oh, I don't even know what that is. 
So I would need a special kind of, uh, I need that tool to be able to do it. Which I'm not going to do it right now. Any hex editor? I don't know if I have one. I don't really do that kind of stuff usually. Make sure I load magazine in this boy. Later, Eric. Where are the mercs located? I just realized I can't just go to the merc base because <laughs> they're not they're not there probably. I guess I have no way to tell without actually like finding it and walking around. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Like I'm just like completely unknown where I need to go. Zone is not the same. Let's go buy some glue. And then, uh, well, let's find some jobs real quick. Then we'll go get some glue. So I don't have to walk all the way back to do that. Quick save before. Bandits in the truck cemetery. I can do that. few guys who are looking for another to join up with them for a while they need to they need a scout I mean that sounds like those two jobs would work perfectly together that's the one <laughs> I saw your message too uh, too late Ventar okay well now I'll try to remember it's those scout mission Oh, <laughs> she didn't like me picking her up. She just wanted to stand next to me and look at me. <laughs> she hates it. She's so cute when she's angry. She's so cute when she's mad. Little vicious furball. Uh, there's guy in the car. I mean, it's a different job, but I'll do that. Don't do that one. Clear around the Great Swamps. Free soccer and cordon. Yeah, I mean, those are two in the same direction. I'll do it. Yeah, it's only two jobs too. Okay. The barkeep might have uh, some work too. See if there's anything going south. Maybe it needs time to uh, get work since he just uh, just arrived at the bar. What cat? Oh, she's like so needy, but doesn't want me to pet her. It's like pet me with your eyes. What kitty? What? I think so. The follow, Gadolin. Stand there looking at me. What you want? Okay, just need some cheap 
Go ahead and fix up my overcoat. It's gonna be a while before I get into suit, so I should. Hey, sounds great, Ventar. Definitely try that out once that's uh ready to go. See, I don't have the task mods running right now because I was afraid of any more crashes. All right, kill, clear sky. Kill the stalker. Let's go. Can I get some boys to come with? Kill the guy in the great swamps. Can I get some rookies to come with me? Where's the squad? It's 20,000 power, 21,000 power. There's only two squads here, so if I take one, then we'll have no one else. There's one squad watching the quarters. So there's no, there's no one who wants to leave right now because they all, they're all doing guard duty. They're already understaffed at the bar. Bandits are just moving in and getting situated, so I'm gonna have to go out alone. Can I get dog follow? <laughs> No story with those mods. Um, with most mods, the story works fine. It's running with Warfare where you can have some trouble, but the Warfare A Life Overhaul mod uh, makes it so you can play the storyline. Anomaly has its own story and everything that usually works great. Cool. Oh, I gotta turn animations back on. Stamina is so bad. Is it the helmet? Uh, slight breeze. I guess the this uh, helmet is making my stamina bad. I don't know how bad I'm gonna get radiation when I do this though. Yeah, I can run so much easier when I'm not wearing a gas mask. See how that works. We're running that uh, radiation overhaul now, so radiation works completely differently now. Can story NPCs get killed in the warfare mod? I I don't know. I okay. Ventar, who made the mod, says yes. Okay. <laughs> Oh. Well, that's cool, I am me. Might have to do that then. Do you mind sending me um a link to the tool through Discord? Because I'm definitely gonna forget. Thank you, thank you. You're always bleeding with his azel mode. It's like you're, you carry over your bleeding between uh, between switching characters. I remember that being a problem. I feel like his azel is really buggy. It's not really being worked on. I think it needs you need to have like your spawn menu ready to go to be able to have the gear to be able to even to survive in the zone because NPCs don't have all the things to worry about the player character does. So you just don't be afraid to spawn in. So, uh, like a little bit of meds. All right. Got 
Edgar will warn you, but rats don't worry. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just afraid it's not going to actually go off. That's... A pack of boars and cats fighting each other, and some Tushkanos in there too, and some dogs. Or those are just dogs and boars. Tushkanos. Yeah, those are just dogs. No cats. Uh, definitely want to avoid that clusterfuck. Oh god, what's happening? Use plus minus to adjust the volume. Oh, really? Is it keypad? <laughs> uh, plus is the crash button, apparently. <laughs> yeah, that's a crashed RZ radiation script crash when I press plus. Oh, uh, rip. I think that's a bug. Uh,. I'm actually going to post that on the thing, see if anyone else has had that problem. Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. Could be something else conflicting. Oh, wait, what? Didn't save? Damn it, I accidentally copied over something else. Lost the crash. Fuck. I'm just gonna assume something else conflicting. Don't wanna worry about it right now. I don't have a lot more time to play. I want to finish this raid, uh, go kill these guys and get back, and then I'll have to end the stream. I've got some homework I need to work on. Let's uh, do it midnight tonight. Oh, kitty cat. Uh, yeah, we all wanted Eternal. It'd be so much fun, but it's it's tough. It's tough to do. Engine's not made for it. Plus on the numpad is the crash button right now. Don't do that. Uh, right, I was, uh... Make sure I add both of these to my loadout. Can't I add that one? Uh, my ammo just vanished from that. No, it's still there. It's just bugging out, I think. Why can't I do that? Weird. What's the crash counter at right now? It's at least like three or four in the stream. What are we shooting at, boys? It's amazing. The NPCs are actually able to shoot uh, other stalkers and mutants on hardcore AI aim. Not used to that. Uh, yeah, we played a few hours of Area at Star Fox uh, last weekend. It was cool, but it just seemed ridiculously brutal for un like for no reason. Like, un like, just literally, like, unfair. Like, artificial difficulty. We ran into a boss bloodsucker that I put about... What was it, like, 
10 buckshots, I think, like 30 AK rounds and about 30 Makarov rounds and didn't die. Should be walking this way. There's mutants over here. And that kind of blocked off the entire way because I could not kill it and it always chased me wherever I went. Um, but I really like the features in it. Use the SVD for mutants, I think. But yeah, it needs some like add-ons to fix the ridiculous difficulty. What? I pressed F5 and pulled up my AK. I'll check my map. Yep, target's up here. Looks like the mutants ran off, which is good. I feel like compared to area, Anomaly is can be difficult for sure, but it's fair. It doesn't feel like the game is just like, haha, takes three shotgun blasts for each dog. Fuck you. Punishing, but fair. I am running a shitload of add-ons though, so. I think that's the guy. I can't even see him. Fuck. What? How am I being shot? Whoa. Was there a window there? Fuck. That guy was like shooting me through the walls. Like he kept tracking me as I went around. He shot you through an opaque window. Yeah, that's what happened. It was fucking bullshit. That's why I want to turn off his Azel. I just want to play this game actually straight. Oh, dropped him. Yeah, I mean, I guess technically you could shoot through that, but I can't see through that. I doubt he could actually either. But it seems like he was tracking me through the walls, though. Like, keep shooting. That seemed a little ridiculous. Hiding behind a metal pole. Can't really hit him, probably. Can't hit me either, he's just sitting there. The fuck? What's happening? Can we not even hit each other? What the hell? I think it doesn't go through that thin metal sheet. Like, bullets just don't go through that. <laughs> I just wasted 20 rounds. That's dumb. And it's not even hitting him, I don't think. Yeah, metal grating can't shoot through at all, which I never- I haven't run into that in, like, so long, because it's not very common. That's annoying. There we go. Off with his head. Still at least one more. Oh, I see him. Yeah, he's coming down. One more, I think.
Where was he? Good lord. Got my head taken off. Did I have my helmet on still? Yeah, through my helmet. Oh, he was in there and he like peeked out, I think. Oh, a poltergeist out there. I forgot I had a grenade launcher. That might have been useful. Where's this guy's... Doesn't even have a gun? He's just unarmed? SR-25. That's how he took my head off. Damn, dude. I never even see these before. It's a perfect AK. Damn. It's too bad I don't really need it, but I can sell it, I guess. Yeah, it's like the way squads work in this. Um, there's usually one high rank guy, and since the high rank guy has better kit, if you kill a squad, you at least get one gun in decent condition, which is kind of cool. Yeah, I like never see the SR-25 ever. It's just a rare gun stream. Rare gun playthrough. Super rare. I didn't even know it could uh spawn, actually. Foul. Damn, these guys have cool guns. All these rare guns! Of course, he has literally no ammo. Totally able to full auto me though, right? Aha. Uh -huh. Great. Yeah, Scar H is a great gun. It's just hard to find, hard to maintain. Stamina. It's too bad the foul is pretty broken. How much you can do with it? It does work, Pablo. Got a few good parts in it. Field strip it, but pretty, pretty damaged. What about the SR? Hey, it's pretty good. Just got to get a few parts replaced, and it's usable. Get it cleaned up. And this AK is fucking phenomenally good. Yeah, Pepper 12 is better than Saiga. It's got a bigger magazine. I think it's lighter, too. But the bigger magazine is super important. Uh... Alright, I only shot once with that. That's everyone, right? Two, three, four, yeah. Yeah, I wish the magazine mod just had rare expanded mags you can get for guns. That's how that works. Oh, the unarmed guy we killed was 
a guy just laying around in here, or just one of their traders. Yes, I am Ekimov. I like it a lot. I think I like it more than cements. Okay, uh, we are pretty heavy. I still gotta go to Corden, right? Guys hanging out there, so we got a, quite a trip. I'm gonna leave a few things. Um, we can stop by the uh, there's a stash on the way, so I don't have to walk back into the depot because it's gonna be dangerous. Still bandits up here, right? Looks like it. Miss being able to play shooters? What happened? Having PC have issues or something? Oh, that sucks, man. Yeah, I get, I like, I get carpal tunnel in my hands too. I try to stretch them and take care of it and stuff, but I, I'm getting it too. How old are you, uh, Eternal? Keep your wrists elevated. I don't do that. I usually rest my arms on the desk. Like I have my both my uh, arms up to my. I got a corner desk, so up to my uh, elbow. My arms are resting. I'm 26. Okay, I'm 25, so I'm scared now because <laughs> I play a lot of shooters, mostly on stream though, but. I don't have any, I guess I can get like a, one of those pads to lift my elbows, because yeah, I, I'm lifting my hand, I can imagine that being more comfortable. Because yeah, you're kind of stretching those tendons when they're resting up. I should do that. I wonder if I have anything I can do that real quick with. Um... Actually, I'll have to get something going with this. I have a, actually have a, a mouse pad I can roll up. That might be work perfect. Yeah. Kind of a jank solution, but it might work. I didn't realize that's what those cushion mouse pads were for, actually. I thought they were just for like comfort. <laughs> like it didn't didn't know it mattered about carpal tunnel. That might be too high actually. Yeah, it's too high. 
yeah, I'm always like, you guys pop my knuckles. I always stretch my fingers when I'm playing because I can feel them getting kind of uh, stiff. So I guess that is helping a little bit. Uh... <laughs> Who needs a gameplay? This is a this is a medical advice stream. <laughs> Okay, there we go. That works. I think it's like a gel pad or something, but this is not a permanent solution, but I've definitely got my, at least my left wrist lifted up. It's going to be hard to do my mouse, though, because the way I use my mouse is like that would change up all my muscle memory. Because, like, I swing my whole arm against... The mouse pad. It would have to be a big gel pad to be able to do that. But the keyboard, that's pretty simple. That's just what I just did. Hmm. Good to know, though. Thanks. Hey, <laughs> thank you for the host. Eternal Inquisitor. Zombie. Get a boob mouse pad. No life. Fantastic for the wrist. <laughs> Get an ass. Is this what really the boobs versus ass argument is all about? Purple tunnel? It all makes sense now. Loner's talking about the gunfire over there. Still some zombies. I don't have anything suppressed, so hopefully I can avoid them. Oh, there's, oh, there's zombies everywhere! I'm gonna have to deal with them. I don't really have much. I just don't want to waste the ammo. Fuck, that one's looking at me now. There's an anomaly in my way. Fucking anomalies everywhere. I want to just like run over and knife them, but I'm pretty sure with hardcore AI aim, they can actually hit me now. Turn back towards me, though. Fuck. Oh, shit. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I'm not running this way at least. 
Art's still up here. Run, bitch. Yeah, this is anomaly. Okay. Like the fleshes aren't looking for a fight. They're not desperate enough to try to attack me. It's like I don't want to shoot and give away my position. Use up ammo, which is precious right now. All that shooting out there, though. loners like they killed us duty guys actually I think what are they doing in here they loners and duty I think they killed some zombies or something no that's a loner that's, I think it's a loner just walking this way though boy I wish I had a scope yeah, he's walking towards these buildings. I'll have to drop him when he walks in. Good old ambush. And he walks to this open field right there. I'll drop him. Don't stutter. Aim. Now his friend's out there too. what happened fuck he's in defilade I can't see him anymore oh shit Got him, I think. I hit him. I don't think he's dead, though. Two shots left in this. Gotcha. I think? No. Fuck. Gun jammed? Really? Ah, got him. Kitty, what's up? Meow. Meow. You just want attention? You just want attention, huh? <coughs> Why? I pick you up and now you're like, no! No more attention! <laughs> <laughs> Why? What do you want? Did you want to go out? No? Oh, shit. Did you get your finger stuck in the... <laughs> is this me or is it distorted? Sounds fun to me. What's up? She's just bored. She doesn't want anything but my attention. Don't knock over my drink. Cat abuse. Oh, no. That's, that's the only way she meows.
Want some water? Meow! Bored? Meow! Got one tone, and it's high-pitched annoying, huh? Huh? Who's the annoying little bastard? Ow! Don't nibble me! She angry! <laughs> All right, Thebes. Just gonna lay on my foot. Keep my foot warm right now. Just stand in there. He's alive. Oh, I can't talk to you? Okay. I was gonna talk to him and try to get some information from him, but didn't even want didn't even want to. Stubborn. Suppressed auto fire. Oh shit, that sounded closer. There's guys at the campfire right up here. They sound so close. Oh yeah, guys right there. Assuming they're loners. Yeah, looks like it. They're just looting right now, so when they come back, maybe. Cat! Oh, now she wants to go out. <laughs> yeah! Okay. It was like a waste to just... Fuck! Doesn't know where he's being shot from. I just realized I wasted a bunch of ammo. Oh, that was kind of the last of my uh, SVD ammo. Okay. I think there's at least more than one. I think. Hey, congrats, Ilker. I'm sure that must be nice. Sucks dealing with shitty internet. Dark. Gotcha, bitch. Does that proper aiming? It does. That's nice. Just 
just those two guys, I think. Oh, you just had a fucking sawn off. That was the suppressed auto fire we heard earlier. Hey. Not bad. Some pretty good stuff you had there. Ooh, perfect barrel on that. But probably don't want to hold on to it. That's an almost perfect pistol, though. It's usable. Uh, man, I need to call it a day here, folks. I was planning on stopping by like a little after four. It's taking a little longer to get, uh, finish this job than I thought. I forgot to finish that up next time. I might have some time to stream tomorrow. Uh, we'll see how much work I can get done today. Got a project to work on and uh, a open book test I've had I have access to today. Let's do uh, middle of the week. So if I can get all it finished up, I can, or most of it finished up, I'll stream tomorrow. Good times though. Lots of lots of bug fixing. But some good gameplay. Alrighty, y'all. Alrighty. Thank y'all for joining me. As always, much appreciated. Let's do a raid. Make someone's day. Uh, let's see. Who's playing Anomaly right now? Uh, Charlotte Elise is still playing again. Maybe we can we can raid her again. She seemed pretty chill. Hmm. Play through. That dude's got a top hat. Okay. okay. My guy likes English speaking story. Oh, we'll just do uh, Charlotte Elise. She's pretty chill. Don't worry about it too much. There we go. All right, y'all. Uh, I'll catch y'all maybe tomorrow, maybe a little later. Probably at least one time during the week. Um, I do want to try out um, Misery Plus Gunslinger, so I think I'm going to try that out next week, the weekend. Uh, I might play some more of this, though, depending on how I'm feeling, if I have time to get it all set up. But we'll see. Uh, y'all go say hi. Hang out in the raid. Uh, don't be a dick. See y'all next time. Hi, Kay. Uh, that is my gun.